Hello, I'm Bob Dickinson of uh, InnoVice, and we're going to talk about Swim 5 right now and a neat little feature in it, Swim 5 called Tools. And tools are um, various external programs that you can use to either input or output the um, data from Swim 5. So, for example, if you look at the, um, the way the tool is set up for Excel, it uses the Excel program to read the input file. Here's the DOS version of SWIM 5. Uh, you can use this with MATLAB um, and other things where you can use the, the DOS console version, use the input output file, and it'll run for you. And then I have another thing here where I use a program called KEdit, which is a text editor, where I just read the input file. And then KEdit for output, where I use a KEdit to uh, read the output file. Show, show you a little bit how this works. So uh, let's click on, for example, um, Excel, and it pops up in a um, Excel CSV file, so you can go through and do some editing in Excel for that. Or you can come down to the DOS version of Swim 5. It actually runs the Swim 5 engine, DOS version, and give you the output. Then if you want to look at that output, or input rather, let me make my uh, screen a little bit smaller here. Now I'm looking at a text edit of the, of the data. So I can actually use a text editor and Excel to, to modify the data and then re-input it, put it into a Swim 5. And then we have the um, k-edit for output data. And this is the whole text output data. Now this data is also viewable um, in a normal output file. If you go to summary, see that. Um, let's look at reporting here. find out why that did not do that. So, we're going to put summary. All right, so we run this. And the reason now we can go to summary. And the summary is the same as what's shown in the tools. So if you go to text output, this text output is basically the whole thing that you can then later, you can also see in the, in the summary. So if I look at um, flow classification, for example, you can see that. So just a little bit about the tools inside of uh, SWIM 5. It allows you to do third party manipulation of the SWIM 5 input file and SWIM 5 output file. So you can have your own binary file editor if you wanted to. Thank you for listening.